today we're going to play a game called Lone in the Dark. It's a kind of a strange, interesting, psychological, thrilling game. Let's go ahead and get into it. painting. Oh, she's making paper mache. Paper mache mask. Hmm. So, so far the graphics are fairly decent. Lighting is better there. We are running ultra settings, by the way, everybody. Ultra settings. Go. Oh, whoa. oh, oh, my goodness. That's scary. I like the sound effects and the music. Oh, goodness, you scared me. What are you up to, Jeremy? I have to tell someone what is going on here. I have to try. You're not one of them, are you? Please tell me, Grace. You're not a spy, are you? Who's spy? Them, the others, all of them. You're too innocent. I'm too innocent. I need to get this letter to my niece. She would understand. Just give it to the clerk, Mr. Waits, and he'll post it. No, he could be in on it. What if he won't post my letter? Then don't make it look like it's one of yours. Here, let me do it. Miss Emily Hartwood, Dauphin Street, New Orleans. You don't have the number? I'm not sure the postman's gonna find it without... Jeremy? Where'd he go? I'll just post it myself then. All right. I'll just take this letter downstairs to the clerk's office myself. Uh-oh, Cassandra, I'm touching your typewriter. Better make our way down stairs. Um, I have no idea where we're going in terms of getting there. Huh? Oh, hold up, let me check this out first. I already washed my hands today. Eerie sound, eerie noises. Cassandra should be more careful with her medicine. How come the door keeps shutting? There must be some spirits here. It's got to be. They have to be around. Again? What is this? Look at this mess. You are an interesting character, this little girl. in here. They're so creepy. They do look very unique. <gasps> oh no, Jeremy, what have you done? Activated the switch to a portal. <clears throat> we need a key for this, yeah? This has just popped up. Oh crap, let's get out of here. Um, holy crap. It seems to be blocking us quite a bit. Found a way through. What kind of mansion is this? It's like plants everywhere. 
Oh my goodness, what is that? Oh, this is pretty cool. Well, it's one way down. We're gonna have to slide down past Mr. Bear. Oh, big Mr. Bear. Oh, that's a workout. Tapping that button a couple of times, tell you, you've grown 10 calories at least. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Jump across, woman. Oh, girl. Jump. Better move. Yup. My goodness. I like how they did that though, with the with the room, with the animals, and the vegetation. I suppose it's nice it's twist. Tales in comparison to the foyer. Look at the lighting on on the uh, sculpture. Very detailed. Not bad. Ray tracing would be nice in this game. Music. I think the new game this has ray tracing, wait. but this one, Hello? because it's a little bit older, it doesn't. Oh, it's still a decent game, regardless. Actually, sounds really good. In this Just the bass. Holy crap! Yeah, the bass is really good through the uh, system, and the surround sound sounds really on point. Last night I dreamt that my uncle hung himself in the attic, that we were too late. The house looked different, but it was still called Dorsetto. Definitely a weird place. Feels like I've been here before, I just can't think why. Let's not waste any time, detective. Yeah, you're right. Let's go get your uncle, Miss Hartwood. little run through of the pre alone in the dark just to show you guys roughly the graphics the sound the lighting just gives you familiar with the game and uh my ratings on this game i think it's going to be promising i think this game is going to be pretty big i think we're talking eight and a half nine out of ten you've got the guy from hollywood you don't need anything better than that so graphics wise i'll give this game probably about a nine sound wise i'll probably give it around Close to a 10, it sounds pretty spot on. Storyline is going to be interesting. The twists and the tales, what you're going to find for these for these doors and these bedrooms. It's going to be very, these rooms are going to be like all kind of different. So whatever you go into and explore, you're going to find something new and different. So I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. So overall rating, I'll give about 9 out of 10 so far. And I think this game is going to be promising. Price wise, I think it's going to be about $60, $70. So. Yeah, your normal price. Okay. Here's what it is. Big shout out to Pieces Interactive and THQ Nordic. This is the game developers, graphics engine, Plex, and then it's the actual game itself. Make sure it's smooth. If you guys are new, subscribe as much as I like. Let me know what you think about this video. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.